What we're gonna do... Oh! It meant destroys all cities right now. What is happening? To self care, the gaming show where I play whatever I want. You know what's going on. Okay, it's time to join me around the campfire to make some spasmores because it's time for spamore. So, a little recap on what's happened so far. We were little bugs in the sea. We evolved into quite a weak and pathetic imitation of a xenomorph, I would say. And then we evolved into xenomorph terror machines, mowing down every enemy we came across and friend, not even just enemy. And uh, we've pretty much been keeping that energy. We've pretty much been keeping that violent, homicidal energy. So we're in the civilization stage. I think next we go to space? As I've said before, this is all new territory to me. I don't know anything about this. But I'm assuming we're about to be able to terrorize people in space. I love that you guys love this series so much because I feel like this would be the most infuriating thing to watch because I wait two months in between every episode and don't remember anything I was doing. This is our first city where we started. Yellow has uh, sent a little ship to my port. I don't know if they're spying. Oh my God, goofy ass. What kind of goofy ass Dr. Seuss ass vehicle is this with the spirally horns all over it? Are they trying to to like religi religiousize me? Is that what that I means? I don't even know. I'll kill them if they try anything. So basically we only have a few more people to take over. We've taken over this entire continent. Everybody else, it looks like only has one singular city. It's really just a matter of who wants to die first. Oh, we can see how all their economies are doing. These people are making 800 a minute. How much are we making? 3,200 galaxy bucks or whatever the fuck. We're so rich beyond their wildest dreams. We have have all the spice holes. It annoys me a little bit that we don't automatically take over the spice mines of the people we take over. I don't know, like, wild idea. I just feel like if you take over somebody's entire country, you deserve their mines. But that's just me. Um, I'm definitely thinking either yellow or red, because they're both kind of invading my space right now. Maybe we do red. They're, like, the biggest threat. Just send my planes over there, right? I'm kind of just balls to the walling right now. Uh, capture. That seems pretty easy. Oh, they're having a party. Mm, we're gonna have to cut that short, guys. Look at their little pink outfits. Whoa, this is crazy to just zoom in and observe people's societies. What are they doing? What are they thinking about, do you think? Look how close Red is to me. They've got all their little guys swarming around, and that's not happening. We're lasering. We're lasering them. They're trying to defend themselves. We're dogfighting. We're dogfighting. We're positively combusting them. Whoa, Red and Yellow are at war. Yellow's like trying to take over this, this Red spice hole. There's a lot happening in front of me. We're fucking them over unbelievably right now, though. Are they even doing anything to us? This guy's positively being drained of all life energy. Do we have to destroy all their buildings? Also, I don't think the ships can fight us, actually. Oh, we're killing him anyway. I don't think the ships can do anything to us, but one of my guys just fucked him up anyway for no reason. Did he deserve it? What does he look like? What does your boat look like? Oh my God, there's some Dr. Seuss ass looking motherfuckers too. My guys aren't even losing health at all. I mean, how are you gonna fight this? Sure. Listen to us talking to each other like it's Star Wars. The alarm's going off, everybody racing, racing for their lives. Yeah, see, I don't love to hear the panic. Can you guys hurry up? Look at these goofy, goofy ass vehicles, dude. Little ladybug on wheels? Is that supposed to be threatening to me? Oh, mmm. And now we go for their homes, and now we go for the civilian homes. I don't know about that, you guys. Could we just... Oh, do we have to do all that? I know those guys from the bathrooms. Oh, could I use my special abilities? I guess I don't need to now. I should have tried to nuke them. Yeah, that's about right. That's about how we do it. The way our legs and tails are glitching around. Don't worry about that. 
No, look, because they converted gratefully to our civilization. They said, thank you for saving us. Thank you for saving us. We've realized how pathetic and inferior we were before, and we are happy to be part of your greater society. I think that's what they said. And military. And I got yet another nuke. Hold on. You're saying I can simply pay 48,000 space bucks to destroy a city instantly? Should we destroy Orange right this very second? Because they're trying to take my spice mines. Oh, no, they're trying to talk to me. What is this civilization? I didn't know they could try to talk to me. For our cities to grow, our economies must grow. We would like to establish a trade route. Maybe they just saw me destroy Red and they're scared for their lives. They're shitting their pants. Sorry, they're, they don't have pants. They're just shitting. They don't have to be shitting something. They're just shitting. Absolutely not. We don't do diplomacy here. We don't do diplomacy here, actually. What we're gonna do... Oh! It meant destroys all cities right now. What is happening? That was beyond my wildest dreams. Did you hear the happy, the little whistling? How is it that easy? I say after I put the game on easy. I definitely put the game on easy. I didn't know we were gonna be done that soon. You guys, I didn't know the nuke was worldwide. I didn't know the, the nuke was worldwide and instant. That seems a little bit overpowered. <laughs> like, you're kidding. What? Look at this rubble. The damage I've done. Will these places ever recover? Everywhere is a steaming pile of rubble. Is this really what I wanted for the world? Is this what I... Or we love it. Do we love it? Are we like reveling in the garbage? We look like we love it. You guys, when you zoom in, the sounds are unbelievable. I suppose that's it, right? Is there any purpose to me trying to sit around and make more money? What does money even mean? Oh my God, the fireworks, please. What does money even mean if we are the only society anymore? If there's nobody to trade with or buy things from, you know? I guess we're advancing to space. All right, look at our beautiful history again. Look at all our military captures. Not war ended. I wouldn't really call it a war. I don't think they really put up much of a fight. It was kind of of just um i would say like the natural order of things coming to fruition i think that's that's probably how i would describe it but we are squarely in the military zone wow look at our entire freaking history across time what is this little blip where we went up away from the evil side oh because we made that one ally this was a this was a bad time for us and then we went right back to the dark side forever yes whoa this just came out of the underground. We were just ready already to go to space. What is this? The cutscene is behind a tree. Okay, we gotta design a goddamn fucking goddamn. Those like space fart sounds in the background. I'm so tired of designing things, you guys. In this game that is about designing things, I'm so tired of it. I'll be brave and say it. I'm a little bit over it. We probably want to keep the classic shape, right? Should we make it wide? I kind of like things just being huge. Should this be like the wide edition? I don't know, maybe we should be creative. <laughs> Should I be creative? Does this have any kind of traits? There's no like traits or anything. This is just all about looks. Oh, see, that's kind of scary. That's giving like Cyclops. That's giving scary a little bit. There's something a little bit freaky about this. You guys, you guys have discovered something a little bit freaky. Dude, the texturing in this game is so weird. I feel like it never looks anything like what you click on. Not I need three parts. I forgot. They make me try. Put some guns on the bitch. Put some guns on it. Not the sousaphone. Shameless goofiness happening here. I don't no, dude, put put some nukes on it. Oh, that looks nice. That looks nice. That looks like violent. That looks like my biceps. That looks like violent biceps. I have no idea what this means. What does it mean to go to space? It doesn't look like we're gonna be successful. It's sparking a lot. Are we sure this is safe? Not the 360 of my stupid spaceship. Welcome to space. Welcome to the pinnacle of existence. Oh my god, look at all these skills. What is this World of Warcraft? What is this Guild Wars? Why do I have so many skills? Oh no, this looks complicated. The fact that we're playing Owl City's Fireflies into the galaxy now. Oh, this is my people talking to me. And that's what I always say. Each city has launched a giant orb in celebration. Not the celebration orbs. What does that mean? Oh, it's just a flying tutorial. Oh, this is strange. Guys, what? Look how much is going on in these menus. Whoa, look at this ring. What is that? Space is crazy. Our planet has a ring. Okay. 
fly to the orbs. Flying to the orbs currently. Flying to the orbs successfully. Actually, this is easy. If there's one thing about me, it's I love flying into orbs. Anybody could tell you this. Whoa, look at the beautiful ass sun over there. Rising and setting. Space is crazy. This is fulfilling all my wildest dreams. Look at me go. Gorgeous. Kondri Sanawi. Oh my god, this is like Star Wars. Because they speak silly little languages in Star Wars, too. Have you guys seen Star Wars? Okay, I have a scanner. They want me to scan an animal. So I'm a veterinarian, too, now, I think. My problem with tutorials like this that just point at things for you to click on is my, my dumb idiot brain is just, like, clicking where the arrows say, and I'm not retaining any information. Okay, okay. The radar is telling me where to go. Oh, I make like ripples on the water when I get close to it. Am I doing it? Am I scanning you? Oh, click, click on you? I've identified wobbledy wobble. I'm a scientist, I'm a scientist. Your ship is equipped with an abduction beam? We already scanned him and now we're gonna abduct him? He's on our planet. Why do I need to abduct him into space for our scientists on the planet to study him? This isn't making a lot of sense, my dude. I'm sorry I have to do this. This is my sadistic scientists want me to do this. Yeah, they just want me to drop it off in a city. So somebody couldn't have sent a car? We have cars. I invented some beautiful cars. Oh, I dropped him too far? A little thing came up saying I killed him. I dropped him too far. Nobody told me that. Nobody told me to be careful. Do I have to go find another wobbly wobble? Oh no. I killed the specimen, you guys. No, I dropped him again? What's wrong with me? Oh, I have to hold it down. Sorry. I'm new to this. I'm new to this abducting people thing. Good grief. Go to a city and drop him down gently. Gently. What am I doing wrong? Do I have to hold that button down too? What am I doing wrong? Beaming you down gently. I'm gonna hold it down. Sorry, I had to hold it down, I guess. I guess we don't have to wait for scientists to pick you up. You're just like hanging out. Okay, and now I'm just, now he's just telling me to massacre them all. I don't know why I'm acting like I care. I'm, I'm no stranger to genocide. He's pretty close to some other guys that are innocent, but I, it's probably safer if I just laser all of them. It's probably safer if I just laser all of you indiscriminately. E sorry, sorry about the collateral damage, guys. It's a little unwieldy, the laser, I would say. It's a little unwieldy. Don't hang out with infected guys if you don't want to get lasered. Maybe that's the lesson here. Hell yeah, buy an interplanetary drive. I have 100,000 space bucks. That's nothing to me. Look at me go. I'm a captain. You guys, this looks complicated. This looks like a real game. This is finally becoming like a real game. I have like missions and stuff. We're flying to another planet. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna mouse wheel us up into space. Just wait. Three, two, one, blast off. Whoa. <gasps> Look at us go. Are you kidding? This is crazy. This is insane. I never- I never knew anything about this whole part of the game. And I can rotate it around? I love space, are you kidding? Do we have a moon? Look at that little moon! We're going over here, I think. A- Agiara? Agiara? Is where we're being told to go. Look at us go! How is this game so cool? Sorry, I'm getting a little bit like wholesome because I'm having a good time and I'm forgetting that I'm supposed to be evil. Never mind, I'm feeling evil. Not the radar vision. A crashed spacecraft. Wow, this is like sci-fi all of a sudden. Look at me go. Look at me go. Beaming down. Beaming down. Beam me down, Scotty. Oh, it's a winter wonderland. You guys, this planet is a winter wonderland. Look at me go. I found it. Located. Hold on. Scanning. This is literally Star Trek. It's like a mystery. It's an arrow pointing to a hole. I can't believe my luck. Wait, the wreck has triggered a transfer beam. Some items are coming aboard. It's literally Star Trek. What's going on? Missiles and an interstellar drive with an unknown star's coordinates programmed into it. We're gonna go find another civilization. What do I do about the hole? It's just telling me to leave now, but I would like to know more about the hole. Is there nothing else here? I love the water rippling when we go down close to it. This is crazy just to like sit in the vibe of the different planets. Whoa. Launching, launching. Launching into space again. Wait, look at our moon! Our moon tagging! Can I go there? I like how I went to a completely different planet before I went to our own moon. 
Look at the moon! Whoa, what's happening? It's erupting? Did I get hurt? Whoa, this place is dangerous. But it has some kind of spice holes too. It has green spice holes. Our moon is a dangerous place. Oh my God, the crazy music and stuff. This is literally Star Trek. Okay, we're leaving the solar system now. So I just keep zooming out even from here to get to galactic. Okay, we're going to a different star. Wow. Dude, nobody told me the coolest space game is Spore. <laughs> this is so wild. Not Phineas. Where's Ferb? Literally, like, no offense, what kind of name is Ferb? If I may be so bold, what kind of name was Ferb in the first place? Oh no, we're scanning again. This is making me think we're, like, doing a drone strike. Also, like, what is better about this view? It's just green. What's different about this view than using our regular eyes is that it's green. So all these aliens died. I like how we're acting like we're concerned. When, like, we easily could have been the ones that killed them. We've been killing everybody we come across. If they weren't already dead, we probably would be killing them right now. Oh... So sad. Scanning, scanning. Oh my god, I'm Spock. Oh no. Activity? Again, it's just green. It's just green, but that's okay. The Enterprise?! Hold on. Hold on. Kirk. All Groks intruders will be terminated. Captain Kirk, we are not Groks. It's Spock. It's your best friend, Spock. I'm too enthralled by the Star Trekness of it all. <gasps> no! No, no, no. I don't want beef with the Federation. I don't want beef. Oh, no, 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 no. Who am I kidding? Who am I kidding? I'm evil. They're never going to let the Xenomorphs into the Federation. I would have to renounce my evil ways. That I'm not going to do. I'm going to run away like a pussy is what I'm going to do. Because I don't even have any weapons, I don't think. Finally, I'm being given a colonization tool. It's all I've ever wanted. Yeah, here, repair me, please. Oh my god, baby's first planetary colony happening right before your eyes. Look at our gorgeous, beautiful, shining sun. This is so mesmerizing in every way. Colonize the planet... My Milo Milo no men. Look at all these stars. Look at all these freaking stars. The universe is huge. Did you guys know the universe is huge? I can't believe I can really just like freely go around a bunch of solar systems and stuff. Milo no men, here I freaking come. Don't even worry about it. Here I freaking come to colonize you. Frankenstein ass planet. I will place you down by a spice hole. Should I put you? Do you want to be up on this hill? Never mind. You don't get a choice. Oh, your planet is kind of like. This seems dangerous. Is this really where we want to be? Your planet is shitting at me and it's hurting. Um, I'm gonna put you right here. Just gonna beam you down and wish you luck. <laughs> Good luck with that. Did they make a little dome for themselves to live in? It's like an atmosphere dome? Oh, I can add houses and factories and stuff here just like at home. The Zynga Flirtnert, and I've always said that. See, now it's making me establish contact with somebody. As you know, I don't love diplomacy, but the tutorial is forcing me to. On any other terms, I would never be doing this. I would never be talking to people. Do I look like somebody that would talk to people? Don't answer that. Can you repair me, please? This is crazy. I didn't know I could alter my cities after the fact. Should I do this to try and make more money? I think I have the city planning thing figured out. You just have to sandwich factories and then houses and then entertainment. I could plan a city in real life, probably. This is like, I'm doing like zoning districts right now. I don't know if this is helping me. It's saying I'm getting income from this. Is that true? <laughs> Not quite sure. Not quite sure what's going on here. I don't know if I just did that for no reason. Find an alien empire. Okay, let's slay away again. Wait, so anybody? What do you mean? Anybody? It doesn't matter who? It's not even pointing me in a direction. It just says find somebody. You think that's easy? I don't know. Let's try si Siren Gopa. Whoa, this does not look like it's sustaining life. Are we gonna get sucked in? Be careful. Oh my God, I'm gonna get sucked. This looks like a black hole or something. Let's not do that. Let's zoom back out. That's scaring me. What is this? Hello? Am I just flying around randomly? The radar cracks me up. It's a hole. It's a spice hole. We've seen them before. I've seen this a million times. I see this any day. I'm looking for an empire. Are we really just supposed to fly wildly until we find somebody? Oh, we can't approach the gas giant. Wow, she's beautiful though. Look at those beautiful swirling clouds. Okay, queen, we'll leave you alone. What about the moon? Anybody on the moon? 
Look at this fun little introduction with every planet. So this one is a barren planet. I'm learning what all the little symbols mean. What about this? It's glowing. We're beeping. Unusual scan pattern. Spock, scan it. Get out the tricorder. Green vision. A statue. Not abduct it and sell it for big spore bucks. It's actually called spore bucks? That sounds like something I made up. We find a statue on another planet and our first thought is to sell it? Hold on, hold on, zoom out. Oh my god, we're capitalists to the extreme. Abduct. Okay, get out of here. Get out of here. This place is dangerous. Wow, everywhere is so beautiful. How am I gonna find somebody else? Ah! Pirates! I don't have weapons. No. Right? Proton missile? Take that? Take that? Wait, actually? Actually, I'm powerful as fuck. Never mind. Look at me using my World of Warcraft skills. Look at them exploding. They didn't stand a chance. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to stop here for now. This is definitely a lot more complicated than I thought it would be. The little space nerd in my heart is having a great time so far. I hope you had a great time watching it. Okay, thank you very much for being here. Bye. That was smooth as hell. <laughs> I hit myself in the teeth with the mug. Directly after saying that was smooth as hell. I'll edit that out of the intro. Nobody needs to know that happened. <laughs>